you all need to know that America is not sending their best and brightest, you know, to Washington, D.C. Oh, my God. Talk about somebody who's totally so unaware of what he represents, a person who it represents not the best and the brightest. Um, you know, he sadly suffered a stroke right before, you know, before he was elected. But 2.7 million Pennsylvanians voted for a guy who's, who doesn't feel secure enough to wear a suit and runs around in a trying to get the Senate to change the rules so he can run around in a hoodie, hoodie sweatshirt and shorts all the time. But, you know, as long as he's talking about not the best and the brightest, let's take a little trip through history here. Here's Hank Johnson, represented from uh, Georgia. He's been uh, represented from Georgia for 15 years um, in a House committee. Uh, inquiring to a U.S. admiral um, about the problems on Guam. I don't know how many square miles that that is. Do you happen to know? I don't have that uh, figure with me, sir. I can certainly supply it to you if you'd like. Yeah, my my fear is that uh, the whole island will uh, become so overly populated that it will tip over and uh and capsize uh we don't anticipate that the uh the guam population i think currently about 175,000, and again with 8,000 marines and their families it's an addition of about 25,000 uh more uh into the population the whole island will uh become so overly populated that it will tip over and uh and capsize okay <laughs> you know gosh um nope not the best and the brightest he, he's uh, fetterman's right on the point he's he's right not said in the best and the brightest but you know to update it a little bit and just bring us to a personality who we all know and 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 at least make fun of um you know when alexandria ocasio cortez so well known as uh aoc um came to washington dc she was mystified mystified by this strange thing in her sink believe it or not she did not realize what a what a garbage disposal was okay so, everyone i'm need your help because I just moved into this apartment a few months ago and I flipped the switch. And it made that noise and it scared. You get the point. The point, you know. We took tree and we have a, a US rep who is startled and scared of a garbage disposal in her sink. We have a person who um, has asked to have U.S. Senate rules changed because they don't feel safe and comfortable wearing a suit um, on the Senate floor and wants to be able to wear, you know, hoodies and shorts all the time and tennis shoes. And we have a guy who, a functional human being who thinks an island can tip over. John Fetterman's for the, this may be the only time in the history of the world where I say you're right. Boy, some of these places sure aren't sending the best and the brightest. Unfortunately, they're leaders of the Democratic Party. This is Rick Manning, Americans for Limited Government, signing off.